the British people have spoken, or so Tory Prime Minister Theresa May would like to have thought, following the conclusion of Britain's referendum to depart from Europe. Many would argue it will never happen. Former British Prime Minister Tony Blair, according to a recent report in The Guardian, is aggressively working to reverse the decision and undo Brexit. Although European representatives recently met to iron out a final agreement, negotiations are far from settled. At the heart of the impasse is the question of how to settle Ireland's border, which until now allows for free passage. We have not had sufficient detail from the United Kingdom government when it comes to the border. We had a, a fine speech from Prime Minister May in Florence and we had a lengthy position paper, but neither of which had any decent level of detail. Controlling the Irish border would significantly impact the movement of goods in and out of Ireland. In an unlikely turn of events, it is the Irish people who hold the cards as to whether Brexit will happen or not. This is the first time in the entire history of Anglo-Irish relations when you have had a conflict between Britain and Ireland, when Ireland has been in the stronger position. Without Ireland's support, Brexit will be nothing more than a pipe dream.